Hey there, everyone. This is Jeff from JeffMobile.com. I'm in the kitchen, going to be doing a mobile video for you on how to make pasta in the microwave. Now, this is a simple recipe that if you don't have a stove or you don't feel like using the stove, you can cook your pasta in the microwave and make everything that way. So, let me begin. To get started, I have a plate of dry pasta. So what it usually does is pasta will double in size. So I'd like to have kind of like a large plate, so I put a regular plate full of pasta here. This will grow to almost twice the size. I've also got some sauce. So I've got a pesto sauce, and I've got uh, some capers. And to add on top as garnish, I've got a red pepper and two small tomatoes. And I've also got some mysterious herbs here. I think this might be basil. So the idea is you've got to take a large bowl, a bowl that's about twice as big as your pasta, and put your pasta in that bowl. Okay, and now I'm going to take some water from this tap. Put it over here to the tap. Turn on your water and fill the bowl up pretty full, like that. Now, you want to get two plates, one plate to put on the bottom to catch any uh, drips from the pasta. So let's open the microwave here, pop in that plate, and now I'll put the bowl of pasta and water on top of that plate. And then to cover it, I've got another, another plate. I'm going to put another plate on top, like that, but leave us slightly open so the water, the steam can get out. So it's slightly open like that. And now I'm going to put this microwave on for about four minutes and power level 70. So time cook, try four minutes and power level seven. Start that, and while that's cooking, It'll cook away for four minutes, and while it's cooking, I'm going to take a chopping board. Grab a chopping board from the kitchen, and I'm going to take these tomatoes and peppers. I'm going to rinse it under the cold water. That's to rinse off any pesticides you may have. And I'll take a knife and chop up the these things and you can remove the stem of the pepper there so let me grab uh, a knife any knife will do but uh, so can't really hold this while I'm doing it so I'll have to put this down but you get the idea so I open up the peppers and I've taken the stems out of the tomatoes now I've got a bunch of seeds in here so to get rid of the seeds of the peppers just rinse it under some cold water and all the seeds will fall out. Like now I'm going to chop these guys up into smaller pieces. So it's been about four minutes in the microwave and I've tested the pasta with my fork and they are actually still pretty hard. So I'm going to give it another three minutes in the microwave with the lid on and let it cook some more on again, close it up and give it another three minutes. I'm going to put it on high heat this time. Amen. And you can see that I've chopped up my peppers and my tomatoes nicely, so a nice little red color. I'm going to put those on top of the pasta when I'm done. If you have some fresh herbs, you could uh, get some out of there and, and uh, use those as well. So I don't know what kind of herb this is, but it does look pretty good. Looks like basil. So I'll get a few pieces of basil as well. That would be a nice topping to put on the pasta. Just rinse the basil under some cold water. And you can chop that up as well as a garnish for your pasta. So, I'm just so after another three minutes, the pasta was still pretty hard and tasteless. So I put it in for another uh, another four minutes or so 
One thing I should have added was a bit of salt, but I forgot to do that, so um, I might try to do that now. Okay, so the pasta should be done by now. It's been cooking for a long time in the microwave. And you can see it did spill over onto the plate below, which is lucky that it was there to catch the spill. So I'm going to take this out of the microwave and dump it into the colander over there. Be very careful, use the oven mitts and don't burn yourself. I've drained the pasta in the colander down there and I poured it, the pasta noodles back into the bowl. I'll just test the noodle to see if it tastes good. Yep, yeah, and it's soft, chewy and good. So now I'm going to put in a bit of um, pesto sauce. Stir that pesto sauce up and add a bit of that pesto in the pasta. Get them out like that. I'm going to grab some capers. That. And I've got all these nice greens and vegetables. I'll put all of those, sorry I'm using my hands, but for the sake of the video, all of those peppers and tomatoes, as well as topping with the herbs. Dump those in. Just give it a stir. Mix in that pesto and delicious pasta. It's starting to smell really good. If you serve this dish cold, it could also serve as a nice Pasta fast salad as well. Beautiful. So there's your pasta. It takes about 10 minutes to make in the microwave. It's so delicious. So thanks again for watching JeffMobile.com. For more quick mobile videos, please visit my website JeffMobile.com. And also please click the subscribe button below. Thanks a lot and have a great day.